Hey guys, Ori, David DeFranco here from TechSocial.com with an awesome unboxing. This is the Apple wireless keyboard, obviously Bluetooth. Now, as you may know, I have been using the Apple wired keyboard since I got my Mac Pro, actually, since 2007. Wow, it's been that long. And I love this keyboard. It is just downright my favorite keyboard I've ever used, not just because it's Apple, but just because the keys feel great. I love the function keys up here, and, and overall, it's just it's just an amazing keyboard. And I never really call keyboards amazing because, well, it is kind of just a keyboard, but everything just overall feels great. Um, and plus, I really like the number pad on the right right here. So I gotta admit, that's the number one thing I'm gonna miss about giving up this keyboard. I mean, I'll I'll, I'll still use it in my Mac Mini or whatever, but it is what it is. At least I have the choice. So I did get this for Christmas, which I'm very grateful for. I don't know why it took me this long to get. I mean, I should I should have just bought myself one a while ago. But I'm grateful that I finally do have it. I'm trying to open this without destroying the boxes. As you know, I do collect Apple boxes. I have a bunch in my closet, which I actually should make a video on. I've I've uh, actually had a couple people ask me in the past if I plan on making a video about my Apple boxes. Maybe, we'll see. All right, opening this up, should be just the keyboard, and bam, there it is. Very nice. Does that have a plastic pull? -out? Yeah, look at that. Apple is always so freaking smart with their designs. Look, I don't know if you can see that. Right there, little plastic tab. Just pull it out, very easy. Let's set that aside. Apple wireless keyboard uh, manual. I think you really need a manual, it's a keyboard. Um, I don't think there's any Apple stickers, unfortunately. Yeah. That's okay, no big deal. I'll probably have like 50 of them by now. But there you go. All that literature. Yeah, I said that word on purpose. Let's close the box. Box is in excellent condition. I was sure not to rip it or anything. If I can close it, there you go. Let's set that aside. And here it is. Very, very, very light, guys. Very light. Here's a comparison next to the Apple Wired keyboard. As you can see, huge difference in width. Like, absolutely huge difference. This entire side of the keyboard is practically gone. Uh, so now I'll have to use the number keys up here, which is not a huge deal. But my most used keys are definitely up here, the function keys. You do have functions for everything. We have brightness, um, expose, slash... Wow, I'm drawing a blank. Um, mission control, that's it, mission control. Spaces, this is actually a new key. This is your spaces key, it should be anyway, because F4 in the Apple keyboard is dashboard, but dashboard is technically part of mission control now, uh, so that's everything in one. Um, F5 and F6, uh, you can set that to whatever you want in system preferences. F5, I believe I've set to, um, what's that view called? Oh, launchpad. I don't really use launchpad, to be honest. Um, Playback buttons, which I use every single day for podcasting and music. Volume keys, I mean, that's practically like oxygen, guys. I use it without even thinking. And, of course, your eject key, because I do burn DVDs now and then for work purposes. And there it is, guys. Oh, and, of course, it's obviously got all this extra space here, because that is where your batteries go, which I do have the battery pack, um, thanks to DLB1752 on YouTube. Um, he sponsored them last year, around October, I believe. So I can now use those key those those batteries for not only the mouse, but the keyboard as well. And that is where you put the batteries in right there. It's getting a nice focus there. And it doesn't really matter. Okay, there it goes. And the power button right there. I don't think it comes with batteries installed. Oh. It does come with batteries installed. Okay. Very cool. Now let's see if it'll pair automatically. Actually, let's let's take the plastic off. Now I don't know. I don't know if this is going to pair automatically. We'll see. Uh, more plastic on the sides. Well, just one side. I don't think that's going to pair automatically. Uh, I, I have to go to my preferences. But wow, the keys feel so new. This is great, guys. This is really great. Okay, I've talked enough. Thank you guys so much for watching. Check out my social links below the video for all that social goodness, and I'll see you in my next video.